Hi y'all, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your daily vibes for Wednesday, August 8th. Thank you for your patience. I know this is a little late. I had something come up and I was just caught up in it. So here I am. We're going to start with one of these and, and one of these and then we'll break out that tarot deck. We're just going to see what we can get for energy. This is what I'm picking up on today. It may not be for you, so you use your... Um, intelligence timing is always fluid on these daily vibes so you could go back for days you know because not everybody's on the same um, timeline you know unrequited love there's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going very interesting definitely there's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going you know there could be so many reasons for that power struggles body language you know um, attractiveness you know there's so many reasons there's so many reasons there's just not enough I'm not sure who this is for but you know it could be the other person you know a lot of people are waiting for somebody and the other person doesn't feel the same that's unrequited love or you're involved in something and, you know, that's what it's come to. That does happen. Ask. Ask us to help you in this situation and we will immediately go to work on your behalf. We're governed by many universal laws and among them is the free will that allows you to make your own choices and decisions. So we patiently await your request See, it's an angel. The angels are waiting for your question. They're waiting for you to tell them what you want. One of the thing is, is that you have to believe in the angels and you have to give them time to answer your request. But you absolutely need to ask. They're always right here waiting. And when you see 444, that's an angel number. Okay, four is an angel number. So it means that the angels are around and, and they're wanting to help you or they are helping you. They're trying to get you to notice something when you see 444. There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. Somebody is involved in a one-sided situation. Or maybe not. Maybe both people feel that way, but, you know, it's safe and secure. Ten of Pentacles reversed. Page of Cups. Oh, Three of Swords. You know, there's there's some family feud. There's some problems at home, prob or problems in a relationship. Things are not as stable and secure on the inside as they may appear on the outside. So somebody's hurting with the Three of Swords. There could be uh, regrets. definitely some suffering going on now with the fool reverse there's some sort of reckless behavior or even being taken advantage of now the page of the page of cups is it could be an immature you know an immature love or 
premature. You know, something happened that wasn't built on solid ground. You know, it was very immature. It was childish. It was, you know, it started out as innocent, you know, but it wasn't genuine, perhaps. Six of coins reverse. Somebody's in a one-sided situation. They deserve more. Um, everybody wants love. Everybody wants it. And this was when somebody gives it a chance. I want love. You know. Hey, it's a pentacles. A golden opportunity. A, a, a brand new golden opportunity. Ooh, the world. Look at that. The high priestess reversed. The Ten of Cups and the Two of Swords reversed. Let me make sure this is focused in. So this is breaking away from... Um, this is the end of a, of, a, of a relationship or end of a fight, end of a, a feud. It's the Ten of Coins. It's the end of something stable and solid. Yeah, it was stable and solid. And at the beginning, you know, it might have been love. But it appears right now there's a lot of suffering. And that's why there's unrequited love. And somebody has been being taken advantage of. And now they're involved in a one-sided situation. Now it's time for them to replace their fear, fear with faith and, and make a move. And I think that perhaps there's been some rejection, there's been some hurt, there's been some sort of, of heartache that was caused by, you know, the other person or, or even both people. Maybe there was even a third party situation, who knows. Maybe somebody that you were with has received a new offer of love, you know, or you've received a new offer of love, somebody you're more compatible with. Like, who knows? There's so many different scenarios here. But there's a, there's a, in some, um dynamic there's an opportunity for a new beginning elsewhere but somebody has to step away from from an old security okay this is turning away from what was once secure and stable you know in your relationship or in your life or in your home or whatever it's the end of that it's a completion completion of something that was once stable and that hurts it does it hurts Especially when once upon a time there was some sort of love. Okay. All right, but anyway, I feel that like somebody is in the process, you know, of dealing with the grief, dealing with the hurt, dealing with what they know they need to do. They know that there's no, this can't keep going. You know, that's why there's unrequited love. It's one-sided. The, the six of coins is one-sided situation. Somebody's not getting what they deserve. So that's the top row. The bottom row is a much different scenario. It is. There's a new opportunity, a new golden opportunity, something you can touch. This could be a new partnership. This could be um, a new job, a new career, a new home, um, something that is big, something that you can take to the bank, okay? So this is an opportunity being given to you from above. That is stable. That is secure. That is a really wonderful new path, okay? With the world card right next to it, that is, I mean, it's its fantastic. This is starting a new chapter, a new phase, a new project, long term. Long term. So there's a new long term phase in your life that is about to start because another one is ending. Okay, another one. It, it looks like somebody is probably going to decide to not keep some relationship going and then another opportunity within a year comes into place okay so this is the new opportunity where somebody steps over the finish line and embarks on a new journey you know the world is your oyster right it is I mean so somebody decides that you know they'd rather travel or they'd rather explore they put themselves out there but this is starting a brand new chapter um, someplace you've never been before you know with somebody you've never been before been with before Somebody has been through a period of loss of self. You know, there's been some self-loathing. They've been holding in how they really feel. 
uh, going against the grain, going against their inner guide, going against their intuition, um, all the while knowing that it was time to, to start listening. Okay, so I feel like we're at a point now where I have to listen. I have to listen to bring happiness back to my life, happiness and bliss. Somebody's taking the mask off. They're taking this. This is what this is. The Two of Swords reverse. Somebody has decided to take the mask off because I'm looking for happily ever after. I'm looking for this, this solid, stable new beginning where I can prosper and I can be all that I can be. So, you know, this world card is is a major completion of one cycle of your life. In the cycle, I think this is for many, many of you. It was a long-term relationship, whether it's a career or a partnership in love there's an ending of a of a phase in your life that was very very prominent okay that's over it's done it's there's not enough like this says attraction in, in chemistry to stay there it's just no longer serving you and by you staying you would be naive and you would be taken advantage of and you wouldn't be it'd be holding back your spirit your spirit wants to be freed okay if your spirit wants to be freed from this lack you know there's a lack of balance there's a lack of peace there's a lack of harmony there's a lack of real 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 security here because you know you're not happy whatever it is somebody knows that they're not happy anyway they take a chance they take a chance and then there's a new golden opportunity so maybe this golden opportunity has already been presented to you so there's a completion that sparks a new beginning after somebody has been in denial. I think somebody been in denial for quite some time. You know, keeping a secret, trying to make something work that was a dead end, per se. You know, I feel like because somebody decides to accept this new opportunity or go after this new opportunity, they find their happiness. This is the Ten of Cups. Extreme happiness, extreme love extreme um bliss so yeah somebody decides to take the mask off accept the truth and stop blocking their own success interesting so is this love is this a love reading for some of you there's unrequited love in a partnership and maybe there's a new offer now you know and you're being called to you know accept it because I do see a that one phase of your life is over and a new one is beginning. One long-term phase. Done. Over. And a new one is beginning. It could be, you know, a new love. It could be. Or this is a new opportunity either way. Whether it's a new job or a new home or a new love. There's a new opportunity here. But somebody's going to have to give something else up to accept the new opportunity. That's all. That's the damn truth. Something has to be given up. To accept this new opportunity that that is what this is there's no doubt about it somebody's if they're in if this is job related somebody's not getting paid enough they're not getting recognized they're not whether it's job or or love they, somebody is in a situation where they are not getting what they deserve and that hurts and somebody's been lying to themselves about it for too long now they've come to the conclusion that I want something better. I want some I want the golden opportunity that I deserve. I want the golden opportunity that I deserve because right now I am not getting what I deserve. So yeah, I feel as though today is a day where somebody realizes that they have to go after what they deserve. Go after what they deserve. You know, have the the new chapter begin, the new start. Maybe there's a, maybe you have to go after what you love. This is an offer of love, so you know somebody has to make the offer or go after what they want or accept whatever the case is for you. Knight of Coins, Knight of Pentacles. Things have been stalled, or somebody has stalled and delayed forever. There's been no forward movement. Somebody hasn't made the plan, has lost their focus, wherever they're at, and now it's time to take action, see the light, and get your ass in gear. The Eight of Wands, 
Communicate and go after what you want right now. The time is now. Right now. Get moving. Get moving. The world. That's the last card in the deck. A major new beginning. You've learned something big. You have. It's a major lesson has been learned. It's time to step over that finish line and start again. Start a new life. Start a new chapter. Start over. Right now. This is the time is now. Communicate. Do what you want right now. <laughs> do the right thing. Make that offer. Accept that offer. This is the page of, of pentacles, the page of coins. This is a card of integrity, focus, offers, learning. Somebody has learned. And now it's time to follow. It's time to follow through. This, is, this page gives you the backbone to do what's morally right. Now, somebody, you know, could be receiving an offer from somebody or going out and... Or I think that for some of you, somebody has received a new offer. Could be from a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. So I feel like the time is now for whatever it is that you want to offer or to accept an offer, the time is now. This is the time is now, right now. You know, I, I know there's been some regrets. But there's also an opportunity for a major new beginning here. Somebody needs to replace fear with faith. We got the chariot reversed, but they're not. Replace that fear with faith. Get your life back on track. Do what's right for you. The chariot reverse is loss of direction. How long do you want to stay there? Lack of discipline. Mind over matter, people. Go after what you want. So I feel like today is a day where somebody is coming to the realization of what they really do want. And what they don't want. And needing to find that moral backbone to replace fear with faith and to go after it. To, to go after it. So yeah, that's what I have for today. I, I, do, I do apologize for this being late. Um, so I will talk to you tomorrow.